So it wasn't too long ago I was in uh, Vero Beach, Florida, the Treasure Coast. And I was at a, a Honda store, Vatlin Honda. And we met with the, uh, the dealer principal and I asked, how, how are things going? And he goes, well, you know what, Scott? We're a third generation family dealership. We think we know what's going on with you guys. You know, we've had you guys for a while. We could be doing better, we could be doing worse, but here's what's going on, Scott. I've got a store 10 miles to the north and I've got another Honda store 12 miles to the south, competitors. I know exactly what's going on. We're given a price, uh, uh, a price with every single lead, just like you've told us after all these years. They're printing it out, they're going to that other Honda store, and, they're, and these Honda stores are beating my deal. Doesn't matter what I quote, $1,000 back, $1,000 over, they're beating it. All they have to do is beat it by 20 bucks, technically to beat the price. And he's still selling enough cars to be happy, but he was convinced that was going on. So what did we do? We pulled this Polk report. And I asked him, his name was David. I asked him, David, who in the world is Direct Auto? And he goes, oh, that's an independent down the street. Are they a competitor? Sure, Scott, they're a competitor, but we don't compete with them. They're, it's an independent. You know, we sell, we have the biggest Honda inventory, the biggest CPO inventory within a, a probably a hundred mile radius. And these guys sell used cars. They lost seven sales, ladies and gentlemen, to that store that month, seven. Of the 75 new car requests that we sent to Vatland Honda, seven of those folks went down to that independent and bought a car. Five of those cars were Hondas. And now David was furious. He goes, why in the world would somebody buy a Honda from, from this independent when I've got the biggest CPO inventory within hundreds of miles? And what we discovered was that they were not giving used car options with their new car requests. So a new car request was coming in, they were giving the best quote, they were doing a great job of selling the dealership, you know, free oil changes, what have you, but they weren't taking into consideration that a lot of these folks that submit new car requests ultimately go used. He's changed his practices and he sells a heck of a lot more used cars now. If you like this information, you should look into the next Internet Sales 20 Group. Go to www.internetsales20group.com and sign up now.